Hello? I got the glasses so that I can look at the sun when the moon move in front of it. <clears throat> what happened when this goes on is that the moon says, excuse me, to the sun, and it's total. It's the totality of it, and it's vital to the ecclesian. So the vitality that the moon present to the ecclesian of the sun when this happened is very important. In scientific circles, they call it reclanching. And when it reclances on itself and the recluse of the moon reclances with the sun, all of a sudden you got something that you might not see for a number of years in your life, if ever again. So you won't be ready for it. You don't want to look at it without them glasses because what happened is you could be walking crooked for a while because things go dark and the moon gets elliptical. And when it ellipticizes, it kind of, uh, it goes like this away. And the sun's over here and the moon ellipticizes. And when it's elliptical and they get in their exercise, you can't see it the right way before without them glasses. And so it's pretty basic. You know, all you got to do if you want to see it and make sure that you experience the total recluse of the heart, what happens is the moon is in reclusion. And what it does with the sun, it reclaps. Now, when the sun reclaps and the moon reclances and they in total recluse like out of way, uh, you want to make sure you see it because it might not happen, like I say. So you got to understand you can't see it with the naked eye. You ain't going to be able to. So you got to be ready. Now, if you ain't sure about all of this, uh, you can, you can, and you don't know how to explain it to your friends, just send them this video because it's science. You're welcome.